I don't know if I have an opinion on that, to be honest, but I get where they're, no, I don't get it. Um, I guess what they're trying to say is Olivia Pope, she does have a position of power, you know, on the show based on the few episodes I have seen. So that's where the whole, you know, feminist movement come from. She's, she's a woman and she has power, but would you say it's a misuse of power considering the fact that she's allowing this man to commit adultery and be allowing herself to become a part of it? That would be a contradict. That would be a contradiction to what the feminist movement is supposed to be about. Because why is she sub subjecting herself to being the adulterer or being the mistress of a man who who's already married, who's already chosen his queen? But she's standing behind this woman so that she can't be in a position of power. I think it's I think it's an oxymoron. And that's why I don't watch the show, because honestly, it's kind of stupid, in my opinion. And I don't really care to be entertained by something like that, because at the end of the day, a black woman, a powerful, intelligent, beautiful black woman can rise to a position of power without having to sleep with somebody. I think that's what that show says. Yeah, she slept with this man and now she has his job. Now she has everybody around her name. But look at what she had to do to get there. Black women don't have to do that to get there. Let's be real. But that's all I got to say about it. I, I have a 